Hey, what is up you guys? This is Nacho here and welcome back to another Call of Duty Infinite Warfare video. In today's video, I'm going to be going over the Volt Corruption and whether I think this epic weapon is actually worth the 4,000 salvage. So, I've been getting asked a lot recently on my streams because a lot of people see me using this gun, whether I think it's actually worth it. And let me just say, this gun is one of the better epic weapons in the game, but by no means does that mean that it's the best epic weapon in the game. Um, there are tons of other epic ARs that I would get before this. I would definitely recommend you either get the Flatline or the K. Uh, you could get the invective before this. Those are definitely ones you will want to look at before you get this epic weapon. Now, the main reason people ask me about this gun or what it is so special about it is because you rank up so fast with it. Now, if you guys don't know, when you use the Volt Corruption, you get 150 XP every single kill. And when you do use a Mark II, you only get 115 XP a kill. Um, I will be making a more in-depth video because people are kind of confused on how the Mark II affects a Corruption or how the Corruption stacks up against the Mark IIs. Uh, but the Corruption is definitely by far the fastest way to rank up in the game. And that's honestly the best attribute about it. It's basically just just a regular Volk with an increased damage range, which by the way, the Volk already has like a regular, da uh, really good damage range for the game. Um, it's three hit kill range is absolutely insane. It's really one of the best in the game, like I said. And then this one already gets particle and built into it. Uh, so it's basically a melt machine for mid range. The only thing that people have trouble with is controlling the recoil. Uh, but my personal favorite class setup for a weapon like this, because people ask me that a lot of my streams, hashtag stream squad, shout out to y'all. Um, but I'd be using the ELO site, uh, the quick draw stock and then for my perks I use dexterity I use hardline scavenger and dead silence and a launcher secondary you guys know for the most part all my classes basically have the same kind of loadout but if you guys are looking to rank up quick or if you guys are having trouble trying to get to master prestige ranks or something I definitely recommend you get the Volk but like I said if you are the, if, this is, if this is gonna be like the first epic weapon you're gonna buy in the game I definitely recommend you get something else do not spend 4,000 salvage on this unless you've already got other weapons I would even say that the R3KT is probably a better option than this gun for the 4,000 salvage. And before that, if you guys have not opened your epic weapon bribe yet or your epic uh, contract, I definitely recommend you guys do that because then you might be so lucky to get this weapon and then you don't even have to waste salvage on it. This gun is definitely worth the 4,000 salvage just because you rank up so quick with it. But I'm not gonna lie, you're not gonna be using this gun 24/7 because I was doing that for a while and I got pretty bored with it. I'm not gonna lie. So all in all, this is definitely a good epic weapon. But I do recommend you get others like the Invective, the Flatline. And even the Cyclopean I would get before this. Any other epics that, you know, everybody talks about being OP, the Mauler Mammoth. I would say those are all better options before you spend your money on this one. Especially if you're a low level, man. It's not worth it to get the Corruption because you'd rather, you'd be better off getting like a more OP weapon and then just owning the competition. I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay. I'm sorry for not streaming in the afternoon, but I'll be streaming at the nighttime. Uh, this gameplay went 29 and 1 using the Volt Corruption. I hope this helped you guys decide whether it would be worth it or not. Honestly, man, if you're trying to rank up, up, hell yeah, but if you don't have other epic weapons and you're kind of on the fence, I definitely recommend you get the other epic weapons, man. This gun's good, uh, but it's far from being the best epic weapon in the game. As always, my name is Papa Nacho. Thank you guys for watching the video, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out, Nacho Nation. <laughs>